hate. Now this is going to be a new series on my channel where I'm going to invite friends or not friends into the video to come and help me bake some food. And today I'm joined with... <laughs> Hand bobs! Hopefully I've edited that really well and you'll all be really impressed with my editing skills. So let's pray for God. Whilst you're on camera, do you want to give a fun fact about yourself? <laughs> She's probably not around to do this. <laughs> Just like say something. Say, oh, I have chickens. And... <laughs> I don't know. Not saying that. Well, we'll cut the fun fact out of the equation. <laughs> Basically, on this channel, I'm going to have new people in each time I film this video, and they're going to decide what we're going to bake. Today, we are baking for an occasion. Tonight is a hockey presentation, and we are going to be bringing this gorgeous dessert with us. <laughs> so, Hannah, do you want to let the engaged viewers know what we are really making today. We are making Mississippi mud pie. Try not to be awkward. Well the pictures we have are looking good. Fresh. And it's on BBC Good Food so we know it's a reliable source of recipe. But it says prep should take an hour, that means three, and cooking time 30 minutes. And it's a more effort one. <laughs> Did not read that part. No. We do have matching aprons. They're covered in chickens. Amazon's own. Uh, <laughs> Amazon's own. Oh, Can I have a drink? Yeah. Do you want to take this one? No, I'm drunk. I don't know. Unless you want one. Carmex lipstick lip gloss on your drink. <laughs> Should we get started with the baking? First step, read the actual no, first step, <laughs> wash your hands. So guys, now we are on the vlogging camera. I have the year six pony going on. First step of ever cooking is to make sure that you've washed your hands. You don't want germs anywhere. So Hannah's gonna demonstrate how to wash your hands. Hannah, do you wanna teach us through the basic steps of washing your hands? Wash, uh, wash. Now we dry and now we we're dry. ready for the baking ahead. Let me get up. Sorry. <laughs> So guys, after washing your hands nice and thoroughly, make sure you don't have any jewellery on. <laughs> I don't want to take off. I don't want to take off. Ladies Bye. and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, we miss you, Jason. Yeah. He might be watching. Yeah. Just like the liking and subscribe, that's the end. Can I see that? That's you like, what do you that? do? Yeah. <laughs> So we are using the Oreo plain. original, the plain with the biscuits for a fine crumb. Wait, is the food processor this? It is. It is. It is. Isn't it? Did you make it from this thing or this thing? I think you use like the smoothie maker. This is my Kenwood, by the way. It's from the 1960s, actually. Oh. So I mean, I actually think it's broken. Two just hand mix. <laughs> so guys, unfortunately, Lamente, the Kenwood, I think, has broken. So we are just going to have to hand mix Oreos into the bowl. By the way, guys, you will be able to follow this recipe at home. We'll put the link to the recipe in the description. Or you can be watching this video and baking with us. <laughs> Dispose of the rubbish immediately. We don't want to hurt the environment. Smash. Stay hydrated. I oh, need to melt the box. I feel like in a minute when we skip the song to hurt you when we're like going back and talking to the camera and like doing a little mixing. so that it can easily be mixed with the crushed Oreo. We're just going to add the butter into the crushed Oreo pieces. Ew. It looks black. That's actually vile. It's a glass in the oven. We're in the middle of a video and we were just wondering, can you put glass in the oven? We're making Mississippi mud pie. It's not pouring it. Just on me. You just wasted my time, you're a son. <laughs> oh, not my name, babe. Oh my god, that's actually beautiful. We so have pretty. the first layer done. Let me know how deep your love goes, you'll save me, let me say. 
face is looking interesting. Ready? to the oven. So we're just going to place it in the oven and we're going to shut the door because obviously you want to keep all the heat inside. And so guys we're going to leave that in the oven for 15 minutes just to bake and thoroughly check through. What's so much washing up? Do you want to start with the washing up? Not really. What's the brownie base called? Put the custard chocolate in a pan. <laughs> there we go! <laughs> Try not to be so boring. So guys, classic cooking error. Here we are. Make sure when you are cooking in the future, read the method before you start cooking anything. Because some instructions could be for a while. So, so the hurdle that we're going to have to leap over this afternoon is how we're supposed to set the Mississippi Mud Pie gelatine sheets overnight. But we haven't got that long till the AGM. We so have two hours till our leaving. Going to have to wing it. Like we can all wing our mock exams next week. By the time you're watching this, our mock exams will be finished. Frick yeah! We're gonna wing this guy. I think we're gonna ditch the whole custard idea. Put cream, cream. on or something. The essential part of the bake, which um, I prefer to do midway through just because it breaks up the activity, is the washing up. We're now gonna go in with this bowl. It's got a bit of a technique to it. We're gonna dunk in the bowl and come up with a froth on top. Then we place this in the bowl as water pours out, keeping your hands nice and warm. And we're going to move around the bowl. Why is it like solid? So it's supposed to be boring. You're not more extra thick. That's like sound dog. Ew! <laughs> Sis. Give me a cake. Mary from the Bible. How old do you think you'll be when you get married? 
28. Mine, 50, isn't it? 50! <laughs> how old were you when you learned how to ride a bike? Oh, I was so bad. I had those stabilised things for so long. Seven, eight? Mine, six, I think. Is anyone in your family in the army? <laughs> right, so, no. Army? No. no. These questions. <laughs> it's part of the tag. What's the worst grade you got on a test? Did that Spanish test and you asked me what I got on, I said, yeah, everyone else got a seven, <laughs> I got two out of ten. Yeah, That's no, no, no. I got one out of six. You got one out of 60 in what? Was it like chemistry or something? Math. Oh, math. So oh, yeah. Right. Have you ever taken karate lessons? I did judo. Oh, nah. Is your father bold? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> no. Nah. Who's your favourite person in the world? Abel Tesco. What religion will you raise your children to practice? Um, what? Atheist. <laughs> <laughs> So guys, this is the end product. We're now pulling up to the hot presentation, screwing in as always. How excited are you for everyone to see? Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this very entertaining video. If you do like this video, please click the like button down below. If you want to see this beautiful face in more videos, click the subscribe button down below. If you want to see this face in more videos, like the video. If you don't like Hannah in this video, don't leave a dislike, just comment down below. <laughs> Smash the freak out of that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't seen my face before. Subscribe if you have seen my face before. You know the drill. Also, follow all of my social medias. They'll be on the end screen of this YouTube video. And also, follow Hannah's Instagram, which is... I'll link it around here somewhere. Hannah Medley with two Ys. Last week, I did upload a video which was reacting to my old music please. I don't know whether I've got the right amount of likes yet. So if I have got 25 likes, next week you will see a recreating my old music please video. Yeah, make sure you go follow us on music. My music is Katie E. Harmon and Hannah's music is Hannah.medley. Thank you so much for watching, homies. Oh, no. oh.